opposition groups. And they weren't terribly careful about which groups got the aid. And soon, Al-Qaeda would need fewer donations. As they gained territory, they would become more self-sustaining, robbing banks, running extortion rackets, seizing Syrian transportation routes, and eventually Syrian oil fields. They were very smart. They understood if we can control those oil wells, we'll be able to sell the oil on the black market and get cash. Um, and they went about that in a very conscientious way, field by field. In this Al-Qaeda video, they are shown planning and then executing an attack on a major Syrian power station. U.S. Ambassador to Syria Robert Ford had urged the administration to quickly provide aid to pro-Western Syrian rebels. Otherwise, he warned, al-Qaeda would dominate. I think there was uh, certainly warnings from people at my level that in a large ungoverned space, um, having al-Qaeda or al-Qaeda